Let's start from uh, the latest coming in from the Office of the Special Prosecutor. Now, the OSP has revealed that it, in its current investigation that over 120 different cases uh, being of corruption or suspected corruption are currently being investigated. The half-year report is in pursuant of Section 3.3 of the Special Prosecutor Act 2017, Act 959, which mandates the office to publish on a half-yearly basis cases it was investigating or prosecuting. According to the report, uh, it said that investigation is currently ongoing in respect of alleged bribery by Airbus SE, a European multinational aerospace uh, cooperation, in respect of the sale and purchase of military aircraft for the Republic. The statement further added that the office is also engaged with Interpol and the central authorities of the United Kingdom and the United States of America under the mutual legal assistance regime. The AOSP's report stated that investigation is currently ongoing in respect of the banking and financial sector crises that precipitated the collapse of some banks and financial institutions and the financial sector cleanup and uh, recapitalization reforms. Uh, it also goes on further to talk about some specific um, subjects it is investigating, those that it has concluded on and those that are yet to be worked on. So let's walk you briefly or give you highlights of what the half yearly report of the special prosecutor um, have for us. So we'll put it on your screens for you to also have a better appreciation of it. So for instance, it says that um, as of December 2022, no convictions or acquittals uh, have been made in respect of cases pending before the criminal courts during the period under review. Two criminal cases are being tried before the court. So let's let you um, also appreciate what these two cases are. This is the first case, which is the Republic versus Ejabing Boatinge J. I beg your pardon, Ejenim Boatinge J, who is, um, and then another former C who is a f CEO of the Procurement uh, Authority and his brother in law. This case is currently pending before the criminal division of the High Court in Accra. The second case um, also being investigated is the Alexander Kabana Safo Kantanka, uh, the president's MCE nominee for Jabing Municipal uh, Assembly in the Ashanti region. That case is also before the criminal division of the High Court in Kumasi. Cases that, according to the special prosecutor, have been concluded in terms of um, investigations include that uh, of Charles Bissu on allegations of the use of his office um, for profiteering during his tenure as a secretary to the SWAL Interministerial Committee on Illegal Mining. And then also um, another case, uh, so then there is the Northern Development Authority, the was a suspected corruption and corruption-related offense in respect of a contract. Special Prosecutor says that has been concluded as well. Now, in the Charles um, Dubwahin issue, it said that suspected corruption and corruption-related offenses have been leveled against him, and on that basis, the Special Prosecutor is currently investigating that case. Secondly, there is the allegation of attempted bribing of members of parliament by a certain wealthy businessman. That subject is also under investigation um, in the, uh, by the Office of the Special Prosecutor. So those are the key subjects of investigation and at least we also uh, highlighted some of the key ones that are done and um, it looks as though the Special Prosecutor per the article that set up the office has released the half-year report, and those are some of the highlights in it. Let's uh, go 